says he will not impose any lockdowns in response to the new coronavirus variant. Hi everyone, I'm Randy Meyer. And I'm Amy Hocker. The president moving slower than other countries that are shutting their doors even before scientists know much about this new Omicron strain. So what do we know about this variant? We want to bring in our Theo Key. Theo? Amy, Randy, today the World Health Organization warned that the world is at high risk from Omicron, but the president says the U.S. has the power to blunt its effects here without any new mandates that have fallen out of favor across the U.S. in the past year. This variant is a cause for concern, not a cause for panic. President Biden says the U.S. will not immediately follow other countries into lockdown over the new Omicron variant or ask states to impose new restrictions. Instead, the president is pushing people to wear masks indoors. He's urging unvaccinated people, including 1.6 million in Minnesota ages 5 and up, to get their shots and all adults to get their boosters. Are lockdowns off the table? Are yes, for now. Pro yes. Pro why, why is that? Well, because we're able to, if people are vaccinated and wear their masks, there's no need for the lockdown. Little is known about the new variant, including whether it spreads easily, how severe illnesses might be, and whether current vaccines work against it. Biden says the U.S. is working with three vaccine makers on contingency plans. Last week, the president restricted travel from eight countries in southern Africa where the variant was first detected. To what effect is unclear because countries across the world are reporting cases now. And Biden said the variant will come to the U.S. Minnesota health officials said Monday no Omicron cases have been found here. The state is still struggling to overcome the Delta variant. Minnesota reports close to 1,500 people are hospitalized, a 50% increase since the start of November. New cases have fallen modestly over the past two weeks, though it's not clear what effect, if any, Thanksgiving gatherings will have. In Minnesota, Governor Tim Walz does not currently have the power to impose any new restrictions, including mask mandates. And Walz has said state law bars him from imposing a vaccine mandate other than the vaccine or test requirement that's in place for state government employees. Amy. All right.